So I just got back home. I went to dad's and he grilled some, or actually he injected it with butter, grilled it and then stuck it in the oven to finish cooking, you know, grilled it to get that um, grilled taste to it. But can't hardly think because right now I've got four pigs in the trap. What I ate today was hogs that we trapped last week. And um, I got four pigs in the trap right now with two outside and I'm waiting for them to come in so I can set it off. We're so overrun with hogs. Ugh. Just patiently waiting. And see my messy house in the background with all my stuff on the countertops and my candy wrappers where I just ate two pieces of chocolate. But yep. Waiting on the last two to walk in, and then I'm going to call and set it off. Just got another picture, and of course, the last two hogs are being stubborn. They still hadn't come in yet, but we'll see. We'll see. Maybe we can catch all of them. Mm. right here gets my anxiety going trying to make sure I set the trap off at the right time mm. Okay, the last two pigs kind of just walked by the front because they're not in front of the trap now. They didn't come in. I'm going to give it a little bit longer, but if they don't come in the next several minutes, then I'm just going to set the trap off and catch what's in there because it's been several nights since we've had any pigs come in the trap. And I don't want to lose the four that's in there just because this other two won't come in. But it would really be nice if they would and we could catch all of them. Mm. We'll see. The anticipation is killing me waiting for these pigs to go in the trap. God. I'm waiting. It's a colder night. We had a front come in, um, and today you could progressively feel it getting colder. That's probably got the pigs up and moving. They move a lot better when it's cold. They get hungry, burning calories, have to get up and go get something to eat. So I really hope we catch these hogs tonight. Or I hope I can catch all of them. Ooh. So we've got one coming in, still waiting. I see two, looks like eyes in the background. So I'm going to give it a few more pictures, see what those are. Like I said, anxiety is killing me with this. Um, but I'm going to show y'all a picture that I took from my Instagram story of the pork that dad cooked. Goodness, is so good. That's wild hog that we trapped in this same trap that I ate tonight. And look, I just got a notification. Screenshot it so I can show y'all. I'm making a dumb face, but oh well.
I guess I screwed up trying to wait for these last pigs to come in because that last picture they were all walking out so guess I made the wrong call and that's why I was worried about it earlier they don't stay long they weren't in there for 10 minutes god I hope they come back this is stressful so stressful Okay, so they're coming back in. There's three big boars now and two, or three big pigs, not boars, I don't know what they are, and two smaller ones. Don't know if the other one's going to come in or not. At this point, my anxiety is so bad that if I get another picture where they're all good and in the trap, in the door, good, then I'm just going to set it off. Because there's plenty in there, and I don't want them, something to spook them and then leave and not catch any of them. Like I thought was going to happen. Don't judge my amount of text messages that I have unread because I'm bad at catching up with folks. But as you see, that one, that pig outside the trap still ain't come in. <sighs> Anxiety. This is what I go through every time that um, I catch pigs and set this trap off. Just so y'all know, this is what I go through every time. So this video is showing y'all the thought process, my thought process behind all this when I'm sitting there watching the pictures coming in on the cameras trying to figure out when the best time to set it off is. Correction, there's two outside the trap. See how nappy my hair is getting with me sitting here. <gasps> Another picture. Another notification. Gotta go. Okay, so it's getting obvious. That these other two hogs are not going to come in the trap. They're probably leery of it. And don't trust it. Whatever. But they still hadn't. They still hadn't come in. So I'll probably just set the trap off on the ones that are in there. To keep from losing them. Just got another notification. Screenshotting it so y'all can see. So I kind of gave up <laughs> on recording that night because I got aggravating, so I apologize, y'all. But y'all probably figured out in that last video where I said I was just going to wait for one more picture and then I was going to set the trap off. Well, turns out that that next picture that came in was a picture of the hogs leaving. And every picture I got after that, there was less hogs in the trap until there was nothing in there. So I missed my chance. But, little, um, little foreshadowing here, we ended up catching them the next night, so it's all good. And that, that whole video is coming next, so I started not to even edit all this together and make a video out of it when we didn't catch the hogs, but 
This is what I go through every time we catch pigs. This is the thought process that goes through my head when we've got hogs in the trap and I've got pictures coming up on the stealth cam out. So, I'm going to post it anyways. Hope y'all enjoy and get a laugh out of my failure tonight <laughs> and my anxiety. Appreciate y'all.